I lost my eye to cancer when I was only two years old. Growing up, it was so hard to deal with. I was afraid that if anybody found out that I had one eyeball, they were gonna judge me bully me, and most of all, treat me differently because I am different. And throughout my childhood, it was so hard and I struggled so badly fitting in and accepting the fact that I was different. I tried to hide having one eyeball as much as I could. And all of that changed when I started making YouTube videos and getting all of these crazy custom eyeballs. It made me feel as if I wasn't alone. Because making these YouTube videos, I have found out that many people across the entire world have a disability or have one eyeball or have something that makes them different and unique. And through doing all of this, I have built a platform of a large family that is there for each other. We have all come together to accept the fact that being different is okay. And like the saying that I always say, why would you want to fit in when you can stand out? But the worst part is people still bully me online and sometimes it just makes me want to give up. Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's Jared Stodd here back with a brand new video. If you're new here, make sure you smash that subscribe button right now because we are closing in on 3 million subscribers. That is absolutely crazy because I have just started this YouTube channel about a year and a half ago. So in about a year and a half, we have grown almost 3 million subscribers. So thank you guys so much for the support throughout the last year and a half. Drop a like on this video right now and let's see if we can get this video to 10,000 likes. Because today's video is gonna be absolutely insane. Let's get right into the video. So as most of you guys know, I lost my eyeball to cancer when I was only two years old. My mom had taken a picture of me and in that picture she noticed that there was a gold film in my eye and she was very concerned by this, showed the doctor. The doctor was like, this is very, very weird. So he sent me to a different hospital to do tests and x-rays. The test results came back and they figured out that I had a rare type of cancer in the retina of my eye called retinoblastoma. However, I was too young to remember this, so I have no idea because I was only two years old, but the doctors gave my parents two options and those two options were option one, go through chemotherapy, which would allow me to keep my eyeball. However, there was a 50-50 chance of me dying. And the second option was to take out my eye and take out all the cancer with it. So without a doubt in my parents' mind, they did not want me to die. So they took out my eye and took out all the cancer with it. Growing up with one eye has actually been very, very hard on me. Like you guys have only seen me get these crazy custom eyeballs and use my eye in videos and have fun with it. However, there has been a lot of dark times with me having one eyeball. And sometimes I just feel like giving up. I make YouTube videos based on my disability of having one eyeball and I love to have fun with it and be different and it is honestly the number one reason of how I cope with having one eyeball because it is very hard and I get down on myself so much sometimes but this is how I have fun with it and cope and it makes me realize you know what like you can turn a disability into an ability. You just have to be positive and want to inspire others. And I have honestly never let my disability of having one eyeball get in my way. Everything the doctors said, like I couldn't play sports, I couldn't drive. I have done all of those things. However, it can stop me from one thing, and I'm about to tell you. You guys know that I get all of these crazy custom eyeballs, like these eyeballs right here. Pokemon, TLF, Sharingan, Glitter Eyeball, Glow in the Dark Eyeball, Renegon, Sage Mode, Terminator, Green Eye, and all of these crazy custom eyeballs. I get all of these eyeballs because I have one eyeball and I have the ability to stand out and be different than everyone else and get these crazy custom eyeballs because not many people can do that. And I wanna make the most of my disability and have fun with it because I feel like God put this in my life for a reason and that reason is to inspire others to be different and accept themselves for who they truly are. However, there is one thing that always gets in the way and that one thing is haters. Every day when I check my social media, I receive hundreds of negative and disappointing comments towards me and my disability. And since I've started making these videos, I have became such a happier person because I have accepted myself for who I truly am and I am helping others accept themselves as well. And it is the greatest feeling in the world. However, through doing all of this, I receive so many negative comments like, this guy is using his eyeball for clout or this guy just gets random eyeballs for no reason or this guy is Mike Wazowski or this guy is a Cyclops or this is One-Eyed Willy or all of these negative comments and it just kills me inside. Recently, I have been getting so many new eyeballs thanks to Zach the Ocularis for allowing me to get all these eyeballs 
And through getting all these eyeballs, I have received so many negative comments about me getting eyeballs and I get new eyeballs every single day. And that is not the case. And it just ticks me off to get so much hate online when I'm trying to impact and inspire others to be different and accept themselves for who they truly are. The first 19 years of my life, I was so embarrassed and so ashamed of having one eyeball because I thought everybody was gonna make fun of me and judge me, so I tried to hide it as much as possible. And I never even knew that I was gonna make these videos or become a social media influencer. I was actually going to school to be a dentist and I was in college and I was in my second year of college and then I posted one video and somebody responded to that video with, what is wrong with your eyeball? And I have never talked about me having one eyeball in my entire life online or to really anybody, only my close family knew. And I decided to take the first step of accepting myself and making a video and taking my eye out online and explain what happened and how I lost my eye. And overnight, that video got over 3 million views and in less than one month, I had over 1 million followers on TikTok describing my story and no one had ever seen that before online. And I honestly thought that I was the only person with one eyeball. Like, I never knew anybody that had one eyeball. And when I started making these videos, I began to realize that I am not the only person that has one eyeball or a difference or a flaw in themselves. And I decided to take it upon myself to inspire others to stand out, be who they are, and accept themselves because being different is freaking awesome. Through all of that, I have received so much hate over the past couple years, and sometimes I just feel like giving up. But at the end of the day, I realized that I cannot give up because I started this to inspire everyone in the world that's different and has a disability and has a hard time accepting themselves. And I am not giving up until that mission is accomplished because this world is full of so much hate nowadays and it needs love and hope to bring us back together and although I get this hate I will never let the haters stop me because I am trying to make a difference and inspire as many people as I possibly can it ticks me off to see those comments but I will never stop getting custom eyeballs because I love being different and getting these crazy eyeballs for you guys because I know you guys love seeing them so please drop a like on this video right now if you are a true supporter of my channel it means the absolute world to me I would not be where I am today without your support so thank you so much from the bottom of my heart but with that being said I want to know what eyeball you guys want me to get next because I am not stopping for the haters and I will never stop baby I'm actually considering posting daily YouTube vlogs so if you guys would want to see me post a YouTube video every single day please let me know in the comments right now and if I get enough comments I will start posting YouTube vlogs daily so please let me know in the comments right now that is going to end today's video I just wanted to give you guys a quick update of my mind and how I felt recently but I've had this stirring up in my mind about giving up and all these hate comments recently and I just wanted to be transparent and be honest with you guys because although I may seem happy every single video about getting these new eyes and making all these crazy fun videos it can be very stressful on me because of the haters out there but I just want to let you guys know that I would not be where I am without your support and I will never ever let a hater stop me because we are one big happy family on Jared Stodd's channel and we are here to impact the world and let everybody know that being different is freaking awesome so with that being said drop a like on this video right now and I will see you guys in a couple of days peace